knew Jerry was talented the first time I heard him do music. It's funny how the daytime could make the nighttime lose its shine. I come from New York, I guess I got a New York state of mind. I've seen him for years working on this craft and perfecting this craft. Yours is a letter to my best friend. There's nothing else that can explain that. This did not happen overnight, and this is not easy, and this is a daily grind. And he was successful in, you know, his songwriting, and he started producing. I sat him down, I said, listen, man, I just want to really assess who you are as an artist, because they're trying to hone you into this one little genre. The beauty of your art is that you write your own shit, and you don't get told what to say. And the pieces just started coming together. It's not something you're going to see every day, someone coming from a songwriter to building their artists as themselves. Like the music thing, it's nothing new to me. You know, I've been around a few artists and this right here is just it's something special, you know? Like it's crazy to see the response from the people in a short time. It's hard work, man. Dedication, good management. First couple moments of knowing Jerry, I knew that music was going to be his life and I knew he'd never give up and he'd always keep working at it. So we decided to print up the CD, old school way, break it up into three parts, rock, rap, and reggae. Gave three songs per part. It's so about like the fan and like the person that is taking the time to listen to his art. It's what keeps him moving. He decided to write a little Facebook status and say, I'm gonna give out my first 300 printed CDs to the first 300 people that will inbox me their home address, I will send it to you. And 300 people might sound like a joke. 300 people is three million to us right now. All right, so pull up his inbox. Whoever wants his CD, send him an address. I'm literally still scrolling. Still scrolling. Still scrolling. Yeah, I'm still scrolling. And every single person counts, and I believe in what we're doing. I'm not gonna stop. Get these thousand CDs out. I'm telling you, these numbers are going to. I come from New York. I guess I got a New York state of mind. It's funny how the daytime could make the nighttime lose its shine.